I'm gonna introduce y'all. We got Cole. Oh wait, I can't say that. They say he was Pickle Rick. We got Jeremiah and Festival. That's your name. We got yeah, boy. Who, what is my name on Discord? Um, uh, boy. I don't even know. Oh, oh I can't I'm read. Cold. And then we got Aerie. There we go. Everybody's in the can't and read. And then we got Hello. Me. Welcome to the universe. <laughs> you are all it's your boy. Mike. You have now entered the shadow realm. Alright, so we're gonna talk about these names in this article I found. <laughs> this Mike. Ooh. I really the best one is Chip Skylark. And nah, no. Skylark. Nah. <laughs> the best one is Mike. <laughs> yeah, That's what I wanna talk about. That man's name. <laughs> I'm bro, I was expecting Chip Skylark to be white, but it's a black man. And that's just funny and ironic. <laughs> it's a black man. I actually heard of two two G's. He got a couple songs that's kind of lit. I heard the two two G's. I called him twenty two G's. Twenty two G's. I called him twenty two G Z. <laughs> All right. So what's his name? Twenty two G Z. That sounds like you trying to say Jay Z. Just mad twenty two Jay Z sitting next to each other. <laughs> Maybe that's what he was doing. Oh. Or who knows that? This man, Skylark. this man choose Skylark on his list. He look like... Oh, that's from Fairly Our Parents, bro. If you don't like, know, then... He look like, like 50 cents on the literature. His name is hey, Skylark, but he look like the skinny version of Maxo. Uh, <laughs> Maxo. What's my the other best day, Mike? A rapper who escaped name. the Matrix and brought back a hard drive filled with beats from the future. All right, so this nigga is on some drugs for sure. Ooh. Chip Skylar. Chip Skylar. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's his description. Yeah. No. Um. Yeah. Sounds like a rapper who escaped the Matrix and brought back a hard drive filled with beats from the future. Who wrote that? He is a fan. Uh, probably him. He's a bro. You're not wrong. <laughs> hey, your biggest fan has to be yourself, bro. You're not wrong, man. Look at me. Hey, man. The podcast. If I was a rapper. You know, that's a good topic. If you was a rapper and you had to give yourself a description, what would you use? Honestly, I'm talented. I really kind of did that, but go ahead. I'm no, I just kind of want to go. Over usage of low Sad songs. Little Pete. <laughs> I would love to hear that once, and I don't know what y'all just said. So, well, Jeremiah, you go ahead and go first. I just said over usage of lo fi beats. That's pretty good. Wow. Creative. Why? Creative as fuck, bro. I said my piece, bro. I'm going to be a sad boy. You already know. You're gonna be like okay. fucking, uh, fucking Shinigami in Nine Tails and shit. He's gonna be nah, a level nah, two little game. Nah, nah, but I'm gonna have, I'm gonna have. Oh, don't no, disrespect me. Hot Cheeto puff. <laughs> All right, nah, yeah, I'm gonna have Cheeto puff this time. It's gonna be Taki. Overdosed on Taki. Look, you <laughs> big red. fucking worm. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> So <laughs> bro, Kobe would just be a broke one in a tiger, bro. Fuck <laughs> off. Oh, no Get a dick. No care. Get a whole bag. <laughs> tiger, but I'm talented. Yeah. Look, that's a couple. That's a couple rappers. You know what I'm saying? There's some people say I got called out by a little kid. He thought I was a little Tekka. I felt him. You do look like a little Tekka, though. You know what I just <laughs> realized? Mm. That's a lot of Southside Jamaica Queen people on this list. Mm. I don't know why they yeah. stuck out to me. Southside Jamaica Queen? I don't friend. like the I don't like the, the fucking description of Mike. That's his name. M I K E. That's it. Mike. I like I it. actually know who Mad Hane is. I actually listen to Mad Hane. I like Mike. It's real simple. I don't know anybody on that list. I don't know his anyone name on anywhere. This That's list, the most bro. generic name ever. How are you going to. Hey, yo, who got my mixtape? What's your name, Mike? Just see the phase away into the darkness. I mean, <laughs> there, there is a nigga named simply YL. So. And I never heard of him. I wonder why. 
There's yeah. a guy named fucking Eli. He said he sounds like a scholar of the Swiss Shakes. He's pretty good. good. I recommend him. You sad? Gordon, my boy. What about my boy Trip Jones? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how to feel about that name. What's up with this other man's name? His name is NXGN. I really got much was, to say about this topic, bro. I thought that was I thought it was a wordplay. I thought it was next gen. I think it is next gen. I thought it was it's next gen too. It's weird. Low key. Well, he's a fine, you know. Bro, Radomir is a fuck. Radomir. Why is the only person with a plugged in Instagram? Bro, look at this man. My boy getting that clout. Look at this man's fit though. He's sitting on the fucking. Is he sitting? Sitting? Is he sitting? He clearly jumped off the stairs. He jumped off the stairs and was he like, "Hey, bro, take the pee." Like that. He <laughs> just. <laughs> <sighs> he sounds like a Brooklyn MC you can trust. A Brooklyn MC Why you can you trust. trust. Any Brooklyn MC. They gonna do something to you. Every single Brooklyn MC I've heard, you were talking about robbing somebody or shooting somebody and beating somebody up. So, Trip Jones. That's they heard the Trip Jones. I don't Jones. know He's gonna click out this fuck ass article. I'm talking about these two Wait. white couples pulling, pulling straps on people. <laughs> oh, <laughs> St. Louis. Hey. Oh, I forgot they were talking Wait, about. Wait, that was in St. Louis? Yes. Damn, I White know. couple aims guns at St. Louis protesters. Who gonna try to protect the mayor? These two people? That or they just wanted to kill people. Yeah, they just they wanted did. to go out. They, they didn't want. I guess they want people not to get on their lawn, but you made it kind of worse. What fucking lawn? All this shit, bro. Why people doing white people break. shit? You already know what to do. They are doing some white people shit, dog. Definitely some white people shit. I'm sorry, but if anybody, but if people start trying to use Black Lives Matter as a scapegoat to do something stupid, I'm questioning everybody and everything. That's that's what every movement. It's all gonna be a group of gonna be like, I'm about to do something really retarded, and I'm gonna hide behind this hashtag. Mm. Like the looting. Like, like the looting, yeah, the rioting. And I'm gonna look at everybody who's been supporting it. You know, it's kind of dumb. I understand if you loot like a big enterprise or some shit, but yeah. you're looting. You're looting. Oh yeah, they're looting like, like um, your own people. Like you don't care. Like, Family-owned businesses. Yeah, like you're yeah, looting a big ass enterprise. Bro, well, Target came out and said it's cool that you know that they they got robbed, they got money to pay for this shit. Mm-hmm. Like do shit like that, but don't fucking loot fucking family-owned businesses. Don't. Don't go looting the paletero like it's on the street and shit, you know? Right, like that shit. I want to talk about the PSN thing. I think it's a 10 year anniversary. Let's talk about that. Man, right everybody and their mama are going to be on 2K20. I'm going to be on 2K. We're going to play 2K. I'm down to play 2K. I'm going to play all of them. All of them. I, Boy, especially I already got it down low. I want to play Tomb Raider as well. I want to play Eric and Tomb Yeah, about 2K. I've already played Tomb Raider. I've already played Tomb Raider. I think I played Tomb Raider when it first came out for the PS4. I think I sold it. Hey, can we just talk about how Black Ops 3 dominated on the charts, bro? Like, I'm never Black Ops 3 is trash. Dang. Bro, mm, top yeah. 5 monthly games. Black Ops 3 is trash. And top 5 online multiplayer games. Like, is on Black Ops 3 is trash. Are you here? It's in the background. Black Ops 3 is trash. <laughs> 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 I don't want to say Black Ops Three was on was on a roll for like a long time. So even, even now, I was playing fun. Black Ops Three for a little bit. I'm not even going for it. I mean, so. it is kind of fun. It is kind of. And fun. I'm like the biggest fucking. I don't want to play this shit ever. Right, so when it comes to Call of Duty, this is so addictive. Just getting killed and getting your kill back. I don't know what it is. I, mean, I, just, I don't like, know about all that. I, I like you know, killing people and like not getting killed. You know. All right, man's murderer. Anyway. On the video game, is on the video game, I'm not real life. <laughs> That's what I heard of life. I'm lying. You out here catching bodies, here? <laughs> no. <laughs> it is that it's so bad at a concert. I just like killing people and not getting killed. <laughs> It'd be like that sometimes. Do it. I hope so, right? I, 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 I can't speak. 
for this, man. <laughs> you know what? I'm a. Uh... I'm gonna just get high. So I can talk some more dumb shit. I got you. <laughs> no, I'm not. I'm not gonna do that because I don't have anything to be high on. God dang it, Eric. We expect you to be high on drugs in this podcast, bro. You can't incriminate yourself like that, you know? This is a drug. Yes, you can. Well, you're in California. You're right. I live in California. And you live in Nevada. I live, I live in Nevada. Michael live lives in. Um, Michael lives in Tennessee. Why Tennessee? Don't look like a Memphis person to you? Is that is, no, is, that, is that how you see me? No, because you're the only ten I see. <laughs> <laughs> Michael looks down at the ground as he thinks about his life and his and his recent decisions. <laughs> Jeremiah has entered the chat. Meanwhile, more, okay, more, my shit went. Sorry rejected. about that. My shit went silent. I couldn't hear anything I said, so I had to leave and rejoin real quick. We didn't I'm glad even know this. We didn't even exactly. notice. We don't care. We don't care at all. Yeah. No. Also, GTA <laughs> 5 was one of the... Uh, what you call? What, really? Uh, I really thought it was. I mean, I'm not surprised about that. GTA is always going to be one of the top games, like, period. So. Mm, I don't think yeah, so. GTA, bro. Really? I'm sorry. <laughs> just, how, just how history and nostalgia are on is what keeps Rockstar functioning as exactly. a game. Just say That is true. And, and so then, that's why, like, no one's ever gonna forget about GTA because almost anybody who's ever touched a video game, even if it's like the friend that barely touches the video game, has mm-hmm. probably played GTA. Yo. My first experience playing or GTA any other was Rockstar on the game besides PSP. It. Played it for like a day, and then my PSP got robbed at school. My uh, my first my first ever experience was picking up GTA Three from a fucking from a. Um, from, uh, Take your time. Swap me. Uh, Pronounce it. Say it out. You know. Come on. <laughs> you know. Never, fuck it. Somebody else. I'm never. I can't think of it. Oh my god. Oh got my god. You. So I was gonna buy the three um, pack disc for the GTA shit. What, what the fuck's it called? Well, the, three the pack. triple pack. Yeah, where it has Vice City, um, GTA Good Three, game. and. Good game. And San Andreas. Good game. <clears throat> but my dumbass lost my money in the mall. Then my mom came through and bought it for me. So. Hey. I mean, I didn't come over your house to play San Andreas a lot. Yeah. I never touched the GTA game. So bro, are you can't really. serious? But GTA's I becoming a strange road, so it's whatever. Uh, I wasn't allowed to touch GTA. Quick, 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 quick. Eric, you know the headphones that I bought? Dang. Yeah. My mom won't let me touch GTA. Okay, no. Bella chewed through it. Meanwhile, oh my god, nice. I played DC at my cousin's house when I was a kid. Bruh. Well, yeah. What the I played, fuck? I think it's San Andreas. I was running around this robbing people. It was Bruh, I would use the cheat codes and shit to like destroy everything. Same. I looked playing uh, San Andreas for that reason. Bro, my childhood I would of... fill up my garage with hella bikes just for the fuck of it. I remember that I would have like 15 vipers for no reason. <laughs> actually, <laughs> actually, I don't even think in I GTA told Mike 3, the story. I think in GTA 3, like the viper was like the hardest part to find. I mean, all these bonds are certain areas. Not if you use the cheat code where all rare cars are. Yeah, 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 yeah. But this is like in GTA that so much. In GTA 5, and not 5, I mean San Andreas, it's like the cars are just like. It's all over the place. It's, I don't. I don't know if that's actually a rarest car in GTA San Andreas. I think there is. But no, we do know China's on that bullshit again. But the new swine flu. I mean, I don't fucking eat pork no way, so I'm straight chilling. I'm just, why did he, why, where did he get, what are they doing over there? That's what I want to know. I feel like they're doing I mean, something. First bro. of all, I feel like if they, 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 first of all, like when it comes to pigs, like you have to be kind of sanitary with them because pigs are very dirty, dirty like mm-hmm. just very dirty. So I feel like they just like cooking them hoes with dirt, with all the mud and shit on them. He's like, whoo, whoo, and just like dishing that shit out. Put a fireman call in that shit, though. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that's how I feel. I feel like that's what they do when they just, they just 
they just do that shit. Like, I feel like China isn't super sanitary at all. Like, you know what the I've name heard of the virus some... is that they named it the G4 virus. <laughs> it reminds me of that song back in the early 2000s. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They should have named it G6. <laughs> Oh, G6 God. virus, like a G6, like a G. Uh, <laughs> pew, pew, pew. That's how you hear when you get the virus. That's how you know you got it. You just eat that shit. Pew, 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 you start coughing, you hear that beat in the back of your head. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be so bad. I'm like, God, fuck, bro, why? <laughs> it's like, now nah, I gotta listen to this shit all day until I get back. Oh, Eric, I'm crying and shit. Bro, I get the virus. How do you know? I can recite the lyrics word for word. What virus? The, the new uh, swine flu. Mm -hmm. I'm Mexican, bro. You blame that shit on us the first time you came through. I'm pretty sure yeah, I can resist it. I gotta edit that out. God damn. Why? <laughs> <laughs> You, you could just give me a word pass right now, which I've been ha or had it. Let's talk like, about a sensitive topic right now. Right, yeah. But can we talk about G6? What is that? <laughs> this song in the early 2000s. You know that, like a G6. Oh, like a G6? Like a, yeah. That's so hard. Just, yeah, you be getting cranked in the gym to like a G6. <laughs> I have that crazy hard. though. Working in the mirrors, oh, awesome. yes. No. Bro, you think I don't have the song, bro? I got that. There's gonna be a lot of people oh, who, who are not who are not gonna like what I'm gonna say. But what I'm going to say is, got me fresh from out of nowhere. What I'm going to say is, sit so can chair. What I'm gonna say is, is that that you clap your ass cheeks in the wind. God damn it. <laughs> I used to. That was back when I was nine years old. No. So it's time now. We're talking about transgender women. And should they be allowed, be allowed to wound transplant so they can have their own babies? Amen. Does that actually... Yes. What are they be cloning themselves? Bro, how, how does that work? I don't know it's how it works. Scary. I don't know the technology or the genetic shit about this. All I know is found an article. I, I was like, this is crazy. I got talking. Nah, you yeah. know, there's a movie about some shit like this. Really? What's yeah. That? It's like a loop where she pretty much burst herself and she fucked herself and oh, fuck. And she like, like I don't know how to explain it. It's weird. <laughs> what would you be watching, okay? Bro, what for the rent, be bro, watching, bro. Be watching, Red you, bro? Box, Red, Red Box has some weird ass movies, bro. Like, you don't Red Box? Nah, but I read by the I read, Hold up, bitch. You I, I read the article and um, it's, apparently they can do it. Like it's already a thing. Some lady got a uh, a transplant from a deceased woman and it worked. So I'm wait, like, hold hey. up, wait, 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 wait. She got it from a dead woman. Yeah. This is crazy. Hold on. This is getting a little bit intense. Well, people donate their stuff when they die. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So it's the same thing. Yeah. That and essentially, sweet. I don't think it really matters. If they want to do it, they can do it. It's all bad. Yeah. I, just, I, I just didn't know that you could transport like dead wounds from like deceased people. I didn't know that. This ass is really eye opening. Yeah, you can. Or, or, you can say. Uh, what? You can say that the, the, that pussy is to die for. Oh, no. Nah. But it's not the pussy, Eric. You fucking dumbass. <laughs> Alright, my bad. Right. It's a wound. Yeah, I'm stupid. My bad. Yeah. My bad. My, my bad for saying it's an ignorant yeah, joke. Yeah, that's gonna <laughs> just edit it out. <laughs> He's editing out. Let me find out. Can't you please? Let's get edited out. Right, yeah. If they want to do it, they can do it. It's on them, you know. Yeah, I agree. it doesn't bother me. Yeah. Yeah, this shit ain't gonna bother me at all. So I'm just kind of interested. Like, what if they make a whole new species of humans from this shit? <laughs> The only thing I don't understand mom? is if the womb is transferred from the another person, uh -huh. 
is the baby gonna look like the other person or is it gonna look like the one no, who birthed? No, it, it's probably still gonna look like it's original form. There's, there's like no, it's basically like once it's already inseminated, it basically it's already DNA combined. There's no way like, there's no way you can mix DMA halfway through. Yeah, because what it's, cause what it's doing is it's getting the over, is it over? Ovaries, yeah. Well, I'm okay. Well, I know the sperm and they, once the they connect and they do their thing. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. like, the egg is pretty much going to have the like mom's DNA in it. So changing wounds wouldn't change anything. Yeah. Here, pay attention you know in science yeah. class. Huh? So, you, can't, you can't make twins just said it's an asshole. I had to. My anatomy teacher would fucking get on my ass if I did. Why you so loud? Because I'm a bitch. Yo! <laughs> All right, man. Take it easy. He would straight up grade my paper, bro. I'm like, why? Give it, give me a free grade like everybody else gets. Why? Hey, man. He's one of the best perks you can ever get. Like me. I got those oh. free hundreds, baby. What they do, baby? Like windy things. I like Wendy's. And pizza, baby. I don't want to like, oh, like Bro, the fucking pizza chicken hut. wraps are amazing. Man, the wings from Pizza, the the wings from pizza Hut are so fucking good. Level at 2 a.m. I'm finna order me some Pizza Hut. But right now? No, I'm not. Aren't they closed? I'm, I'm not. I'm not. I'm just saying. I'm and I'm also on a diet. No. What kind of diet? Losing weight diet. Why'd you post that? All right. I'm just saying that the superior pizza places will always be pizza. Mm, we're not going to get into this topic discussion. We're going to cut this conversation short. On to the no. next part. Because you know it's right. No, I like really no do pizza. It's better, but I, I prefer uh, Pizza Hut wings. Domino's will always reign supreme in the pizza industry. Uh, but we need a fight. Like straight up, bro. You can't I mean, fight he's Jeremiah. Top. He's five, six. In my six, opinion, Domino's like better pizza hut. It's bro, I'm gonna need to fight Kobe, Shaq, Jeremiah, and Jordan. Bro, I'm gonna get your hands already. Your hands are already. Your hands are already. Your hands are already. Your hands are already. You can call that a day. This is near real. I'm not gonna be dealing with you trying to bum rush my ass. I'm just gonna hit you right in your nuts. We're gonna call it a day. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna dap it up about it later. Y'all right. gonna hop in the whip really. straight to Mama's Pizza, order some real pizza. Yeah, we you see, Mama's Pizza is pretty good too. I ain't gonna lie. I, I ain't really never got Mama's Pizza, but I heard a lot of good Same. about it. It's pretty oh, I've good. never heard about it. It's pretty I got good. it for free from Uber Eats. Mm -hmm. Mama Mia. Yeah, I ain't gonna care. And it's pretty cheap too. I don't know about cheap. Well, it can be cheap. It's cheap. It is cheap. Come on now. I mean, you're rich. I'm not. So I am not rich. <laughs> I just know how to save my money now. I. But don't you use AirPods as toilet paper, Eric? Stop capping. <laughs> oh, but I am not rich. <laughs> I just know how to take care of my money now. I, I'm you smart. White, white feces with iPhone sevens. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, last topic before we hang this thing up. The CIA said we're in a... I, I don't know what they even said. I gotta go look. It's just an energy hologram and yeah. some other BS. I, I, hold on. Let me look at the article again. This shit. Is this like Tupac's like hologram on... Um, nah, no, it's worse it's, than that. It's basically saying that everything is a simulation. So kind of like an how energy, the Matrix An is. energy simulation that uh, our eyes... I mean, I so pretty remember. much confirming that this is yeah. our creation. It's basically one of those yeah, conspiracy course, theories you know people what? making they uh so playing the fame this game. Is simulation. Why am I suffering so hard? I need that to change. Who, whoever my. You know what else is? I found in this article? <laughs> people claim Donald Trump is a time traveler. Time traveler, yeah. Let me find out Donald Trump is over here drinking Diet Pepsis every single day, time traveling through time and space. I'm just gonna look at this man and be like, why are you here though? Like why? All this energy 
if, 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 if you think time travel why is it so fucked you know he's fine he's in this is none of your business okay <laughs> you will not understand the great cause that's going on in my mind i mean he's still retarded <laughs> and i still don't like him because of his whole yeah life. like the fucking whole lifestyle and ejecting that shit in your veins and shit that shit was funny. You see, I found that funny. People find it. Oh my god, he did something so stupid. Because he's like, that shit was human. Because, no, it was good. No, look, if he was just a regular guy or like somebody not as not not the president, it'd be funny. But yeah, be the figurehead, it's kind of I'm a problem. Yeah. The other countries are like, is this your leader? You can't even tell it's a joke. You said it. They said it as a joke. It depends, dog. Some old lady just, in see, Virginia's like, I don't Obama like that. had that anger management translator. How come people found that funny? But now it was Trump. Granted, Trump's a bitch, <laughs> anyways, but you know, we're going to Yeah, Trump is kind of um, racist, kind of, you know, kind of misogynistic. I fucking hate artist. Trump, yeah. He's so fucking. Same. He's so ignorant. Nobody racist. likes Trump. Nobody likes Trump, except for yeah. his supporters. Know, except for his fucking cult following. Low key, like the whole racist thing was probably a publicity stunt to get him to win. Nah, I think he really disliked it. Like, even before he was president, yeah, he was saying like, some yeah, dumb stuff. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no, no, okay, look. Hey, my bad. I guess I didn't question it. I mean, I guess I didn't, like, kind of consider it a publicity stunt, but, like, pretty much, like, that got him to win because a whole bunch of people came out to be racist after he, you know, said they all let me run for president and shit. And also, when he did say that, when he was like saying a whole bunch of racist stuff, it actually got us to talk about him more and more, which led True. to people yep. like yep. Yep. to vote for him, like to like get people to vote for him a lot more. But we did Bro, we did the funny. same thing, but like we did the same thing with Hillary, but we didn't like it wasn't like that big because it was just emails. So it's like racism is big. So. Like, you can kind of see why he became president over Hillary. Like, it's not because, like, she was a woman. It was just more because uh, Trump t- touched on something that was more, like, a touchy subject other than Hillary. But it was just like, oh, emails. That's not really nothing. But then you got Trump talking about, we're going to build a wall. And a lot of people was, like, in an uproar. But then you got some people who were like, no, I can actually see what he's saying. I bet all the people that mean voted for Trump on 2016 feel salty now. Yeah, but if you're kind of stupid, but if you're kind of stupid, we're just gonna open up the country when everything is still going to shit. But we're not gonna talk. Everybody who fucking said, you know, I'm gonna vote for him because I feel like no one else is gonna vote for him, just doesn't mean you're fucking stupid. This your fault, cunts. Over. Now look at us, prisoners. Bro, I couldn't, even, I couldn't even vote at the time, bro. My birthday was three days after the voting. Shit, I was pissed. I remember I voted for Hillary. I was like, I really don't want Trump to be president. Even though I, I didn't like any of the uh, yeah, I didn't like any of the candidates. I went with Hillary. Hillary was Trump. pretty a pretty bad pick too. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, so I said, like both both yeah, I picks were like. Uh, I don't know. I mean, Hillary both made the choice. Hillary. Oh. My first time voting, and I get a horrible lineup. Like, fuck. Oh, uh, shit. I feel this like Hillary. Be too. I feel yeah. like Hillary. She was an iffy pick. Hillary was no. iffy. Because she had a good. Because she has a good resume. For what he did, he just had sexual problems. I don't know why he did that. My man got some head in the presidential chair, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, we all know. It's been, it's been made fun of. Alex <laughs> is ingrained in history. <laughs> yeah. Next up, we got Ronda Rousey. Let's get it. <laughs> I don't even like the candidates for this year. Joe Biden, I ain't voting for him. Oh, I, bro, I like Joe Biden. He started saying, like, he started saying some dumbass shit and stuff like that. I was like, nah. I feel like he was always saying some dumbass shit, but people never pay attention. Oh no, I mean, because you see, I was letting those shit slide, but after some more dumb shit, I was like, ah, you know what? That's enough. <laughs> yeah, I <laughs> preferred Bernie, down. bro, because he was all about like, he was, I don't know, he was just a better candidate in my opinion, you know. But I ain't going to dog Biden, even though I probably should, because you know. I think Biden, he, Biden left us off with a good first impression, but then after that, it just kind of started going all downhill. It's like, it's like a girlfriend, you know, after six months, you know, you start seeing the real her, and you're like, fuck. 
Why you gotta bring up well? <laughs> on that note, I'm gonna end this podcast. <laughs> Bro, I was gonna say, <laughs> we want to thank everybody for listening that listens. I appreciate y'all. I love you all. Appreciate everybody, you. Who, everybody who's listening to us right now, I love you. Do positive things, you can do better, I promise. Everybody who's listening, I'm gonna give y'all the fattest kiss on the lip cheek. <laughs> Hey, y'all don't need out and stuff, you know, because that shit wastes a lot of money, you know. Secure I the bag. Secure the bag first. Nothing to say. Yeah. How about all y'all Versace purses? Why Versace purses? What is what is what is somebody from like high school? When your guy friend listen to this and you buy a Versace purse, you gonna be like, "What well, I'm gonna give to my mama?" Oh, yeah. <laughs> Betty White is older than sliced bread. <laughs> yeah, thank y'all for listening. For putting up She's still a good looking woman, though. No way. What was that? Y'all done. God! Be my meat, dude. And we're gonna end it right there.